First car in here, guys. First car in here. It's got to be a 30 D. Had a heavy one today. So on top of all these beams, because this was for fences and gates, there was probably about a three to five mil layer of dust right up all the way, everywhere. And like Tom made the comment the other day, if you if you're doing a car and you get a big gust of wind like today, it's quite windy. Um, and it goes on your bonnet while you're polishing or a bit of grit or something. You flatten it out, aren't you? You flatten it out. <laughs> so I've literally got on the steps today and I've hoovered. Brushing was just ridiculous. I've literally hoovered the roof, <laughs> the apex, all the beams, everything. Hey, you missed a bit. Tom, I couldn't <laughs> get in the middle. I literally could not get in the middle. <laughs> Take it easy. Um, so yeah, we patched the wall up today because I caught a cat in here this morning. You should have seen it, it jumped about 10 foot. This is just a temporary fix, so there's not a hole. Um, what else have we done today? We've fitted the gutter back on. We've got a new, that's all fitted now. So we're not gonna get, yeah, back on with new, new blocks. He's putting new joins on. So thank you, Reese, for that. That's job done. And yeah, that well, was quite, <laughs> quite mad, doesn't it? It's probably, it's, well, it is, it's the first time a car has ever gone in there. Yeah, and, it will have been because of the yeah, floor, though, isn't it? That's it. There we go, guys. 30D, covered in bird poop. We're getting there. Emptied a lot more stuff out today for the bin. It is slowly getting there. Well, we've made quite a bit of progress. That's the only leftover wood we've got now, Tom. Um, it's, just, it's just getting rid of clearing the space, isn't it? Yeah, that, it is getting clearer. Um, this back wall is a problem, but for the meantime, I think we will just move stuff to the back wall and just work with it. Um, well, that's the main thing. You're thinking peeing everywhere, it bloody, bloody stinks. It does the job. We've had the first car in. That was a success. Pretty much three cars max yeah. for maybe parking, two cars for working. We're just umming and ahhing about the ramp, where we put the ramp, like what type of ramp. Yeah. Well, there is a, a more of a slimline ramp. I was noticing. to say. It's only, I think it's only 2.8 wide, which is pretty much the same width of the doors. Right. So you'd still be able to get F30, F31 on there? Yeah, uh, I'd have to double check, but I'm just wondering, I need to figure out the position of it, that's all. Hmm. Because if the, if the post's here, it's going to be a bit of a nightmare, so I'm going to be far away. And there's no point in bringing it over this way, because you lose the height. Yeah. Isn't it? And I'd say there's no point in putting it in the middle, because then you lose the outsides. I mean, there are different types of ramps, like. Is there anything other than a poster ramp that, that like these scissor 
yeah. scissor lifts, can they get height? Yeah, they do. Um, well, not, not, they normally go up about, I think it's about somewhere between half a metre and a metre. Which is still enough to work under it, but it's not like, you know, it's, it's not like a two poster where you can walk, walk under it. Like you can even get the ones which are offset, so you've just got, you know, your post on one side and they come up pretty high, but they still don't go up. Mm. They still have a lot of research into well, it's not been the um, the priority at the minute, has it? No, it's, it's just, not. It's, it's getting the place. It's getting to this stage, isn't it? So we're all right to put floor paint down, aren't we? Pretty much got floor paint in the corner over there on the shelf for Leyland. Um, it should be. <laughs> I hope. I hope. Um, so yeah, we've achieved achieved a bit today. You know, it doesn't look like it. You'd have to be here to see what it was like up there. Horrible. And it's just the amount of spider nests and cobwebs was just unbelievable. Like it's probably like thirty odd years worth. Yeah, it's just been used for storage, hasn't it? Yeah. Somebody's actually been in here for years, haven't yeah. they? Oh, it's just taken out. That's it. So there we go, guys. Little update today. We've had the first car in. Next stage is pretty much to paint the floor. Probably going to do it in quarters, just see how it spreads and how it goes on. And then at least once we've done that, we can move everything to the back wall um, and go from there. So it's all go. Oh, Got to get this floor painted well, this week we coming. Much do it in two thirds, can't we? Yeah. Probably the best way to do the most. Most we can just leave stuff over the side. Probably start over here. In all fairness. Well, it's clear, isn't it? Yeah. It's just getting out. <laughs> You'd maybe just do that. Leave that section. Well, no, you, you start, you move everything over to that wall, you start here, then you work towards the door, and then when you finish, you shut the door. Yeah. <laughs> uh. <laughs> yeah, so there we go. All full in games. The ramp is a big concern. So I wouldn't mind I wouldn't mind the ramp, you know, like detailing wheels and stuff like that. I know you, you can clean the other side of the car. I know you can start yeah. like wax oiling and Stuff like that. Done. We've got a lot of clutter over there. Get rid of that wood. We don't really need it now. Need to get the sky bond up. We can probably just secure it to that wall for a minute. Um, just to take your eye off it. I'm not gonna bother painting that for a minute. It's a waste of paint. I'll just keep on at him. And if you're gonna do anything, you can paint them two panels. This, no, this one's not that good. That's not that good. No. That's that right one, Sam. So that's the only one you can paint? Yeah. So we can do that and put the sky bond on that. Uh, I did the one that we put on the outside, that one there, that's all treated on the back. I'll use some of the oil-based stuff on that just to keep the weather off it. Um, it's just weird, but that's someone's back garden beyond there, so it's never had any attention whatsoever. So, yeah. Tidier anyway, just the ramp. The ramp is my main concern. Floor, we'll have that boxed off. Just the ramp. Got any more sky bond or is that it? There are two more sheets, but obviously we could possibly use that, so I'll speak. Yeah, yeah. I mean, we never use white in the house, do we? We never use white, and it was free anyway. Yeah. Um, so. Probably can do. Why would you think it would? <laughs> Mask that wall. Just do the wall. With yeah. <laughs> Give it some some strength. Yeah. Log burner as well. That needs to come out because that's taking up a big chunk of space. To be fair though, once you get the bench on the back wall, probably in the middle, put the sofa on the back wall, cupboards, racks, toolboxes. Half your eyes off it anyway, isn't it? <sighs> yep, we need some more lights, but we've got something going on with that. And we got a kettle as well, Tom. What have we? The top of the fridge. Where'd you get the kettle from? Claire gave it me. It's oh, out of nice. the shop. <laughs> she got a new one. Have you got, have you got it again? No, I've got no. Hey, check. Still 
Oh, a crate of water in there for you, mate. <laughs> See, it. it's staying, keeping good temperature, though. So. so, yeah, there we go, guys. We're a bit further on this week. We're going to bladder the place with loads more art, make it a proper little BMW setup, little BMW man cave, and hopefully it'll be a working premises very soon. Anything you want to add, Tom? No, 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 you're saying, Thanks, mate. <laughs> the bath was black, put it that way, when I got out of it. <laughs> horrible. Oh, it's horrible. It's horrible. Right, guys, we'll wrap it up there. Just remember, like and subscribe, and hopefully, back end of next week, we'll be in here. All right. All right, see you later. See you later.